Hi, I'm Chess, and you're watching Chess's Crazy Creations. For this project, I'm going to be using one of those drawstring backpacks, and it's plain on both sides. It does not have a front or a back, so I may choose each, whatever side I would prefer to choose. And I will be using a rub-on transfer to give it a little something. And this one says, it's cool to be kind today. So the first thing I need to do is peel off the transfer from its backing. And then next, I need to be careful not to touch it because it's sticky, and I'm gonna be placing it on the bag. Once I've placed it on the bag, I want to get it nice and pressed on there. Now, if you're worried about it moving at all, you could use some painter's tape or some stencil tape to hold it in place. Next, you're gonna need some sort of credit card or I have my Mod Podge card to help me with this next step. For this next step, I simply use the card to go back and forth. Now you could use a popsicle stick. There are a lot of things you can use for this step, but you wanna go back and forth. And as you can see, sometimes the color changes a little bit so that you know it is adhered on to the bag. So you're gonna continue doing this across the entire design to make sure that it's attached to your bag or backpack. This also makes a wonderful gift or a gift bag even that is a reusable gift bag that they can use again and again rather than something that's disposable. The next step is to peel this off. And when you do, you'll wanna be careful because if you missed a spot, just stop, place it back down and scratch over that spot. So we're gonna go ahead and carefully peel back And there it is. Now this plain backpack has a design on it. I love this bag, make it happen. And these bags are great for reusable gift bags that then someone can use again. But we're gonna flip it over. And besides that, they're good for many other purposes. Grocery bags, bags to go to the library, etc. So I'm gonna remove that. And I'm actually gonna move out the handles to get them out of my way for what I'm about to do. So now you could leave this backside plain and what I'm doing you could have added to the front side as well, but I want to just give this backside a little something. So what I'm gonna do is I've got this rub on transfer that says hashtag best day ever and I'm just going to add it to give the back a little bit of fun. Now I can place this wherever I want. So I could use it towards the top. I could use it in the center. I could put it in a little down corner. It's really up to you where you wanna put this. Or like I said, maybe you wanna put it up at the top of this side. Best day ever, make it happen. Or down in the corner, make it happen. Best day ever. So a lot of choices for you on what you wanna do. So the next step is I need to peel off the backing and careful not to touch the stickiness that's on the back side. I'm just gonna place this again, wherever you want, but I'm gonna line it up on this side. Once I have it where I want, I'm gonna go ahead and press it down and that way the stickiness on back adheres to the bag. Now you could use some painter's tape or some stencil tape. And your next step is to use a credit card, a popsicle stick, anything you want, and you're just gonna scratch back and forth on the design. Now, some of these designs, as you scratch them, you'll see a color change. So let me go ahead and show that to you up close. So as you can see, this has turned more of a gray. So as I go over it, the color is shifting. So that helps, but not all transfers will do that. So I'm gonna go ahead and I will finish transferring this onto the bag, and then we'll talk about what's next. Now comes the fun part. 
of pulling it up and seeing the transfer happen. Now, if you pull it up and a part of the transfer didn't work, that's okay. Lay it back down and scratch over the top of it and it will be fine. Just go slow so you can see if it's transferring or not. So now comes the fun of peeling it up. So one very simple idea to make the back of a plain bag personalized and then the front side. So you've got make it happen and hashtag best tag day ever. These again make great gift ideas and these bags are so versatile to take wherever you need to go. I hope this inspires you to update some bags of your own. I'd love it if you'd subscribe to my YouTube channel and my blog at chasscrazycreations.com. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.